he said he read some probably books published in Iskon about the Kaddish, but there's not much devotional meaning he found in those books. But why? What is the pure way of following a Kaddish? What is our? What is the clear conception of a Kaddish? Is observance based upon dedication. Все построено на самопредании, самоотдании. Observance that does not, uh, how do you say, uh, make us unfit for service. Самопожертвование, которое делает нас пригодными для служения. And that may vary servitor to servitor. И это как бы передается слуги к слуге. Always service. Dedicating, increased dedicating tendency is our focus. So if our observance, observance incapacitates us for service, what sort of observance is that? This is supposed to be an opportunity for increased service. So, there are different ways. We're at the tail end of this class. I don't think now is the time to discuss extensively different sorts of observance. But here at Chaitanya Saraswat Mat, generally speaking, on the Akadashi day, <coughs> Fasting till noon. Нас как бы здесь в храме обычно пост до до полудня. And then anukalpa. И потом немножко просада. Anu means little. Yes, the taking fruits and other things. Такое fruit. Simple. Anukalpa means simple. Что-то очень простое. Little simple prasada. Простая еда. And increased hearing, chanting, and other types of service. Madhavatiti Bhakta Janani. Bhakti Vinod Thakur says, by observing Madhavatiti, this is included. Rekadashi, Janmashtami, and even Dwadashi, everything. But these Madhavatitis, Bhakti Janani, they give birth to devotion. In Garga Sangita, Braja Gopis, they ask Radharani, how did you get so much devotion to Krishna? He said, by observing Rekadashi. И Радхарани в Гарга Самхите говорит Гопи, они спрашивают, как ты достигла такой преданности? Она говорит, просто следовала и кадрышу. So how wonderful is that? Насколько это прекрасно? Oh no. no. That's cheating. Yeah.